guys in tears. She was in the bathroom. You wish. Just relax, man. I'm sure you're just hungry or need some sleep or something. You're fine, I promise you. You're probably dehydrated from all the drinking last night. Oh, well, thanks, Nurse Jackie. When did you go to nursing school again? I've been a nursing major the whole time. You sure? <laughs> yeah. You're an idiot. Even I knew that. Yeah, duh. Me too. Let's go to the bathroom. I'll go. Me too. So, you did know she was a nursing major, right? Of course I did. I'm not an idiot. Bobby, you just gotta understand something. Girls love attention. They'll do anything to get your attention. Trick's just not getting it to him. Girls love challenges. It's true. Bobby, don't listen to him. Only dumb girls like that. Exactly, Casanova. The dumb girls are the fun ones. <laughs> so, dude, what happened to the proposal last night? We were all ready to celebrate. She came out last night, and I mean, she just wanted to wait the next two years to get married. So I thought I'd just let her have some time to think about it. It's hard, man. I'm sorry. This is just my opinion, but I think proposing after y'all been together for eight years isn't exactly rushing into things. That's what I was thinking, but I thought I'd just let her have some time, you know? I mean, you could still propose, be engaged for two years, and start preparing for the wedding. Little shithead has a point. I think so, guys? I mean, you guys have been together for eight years. We'd all be pretty shocked if she said no. Do it tonight. She cannot say no to you, dude. I promise she'll say yes. Do it tonight. Thanks, you guys. I really needed this. Family man, here for you. Why is Lucas so annoying? How long have you been together again, Em? Um, four years. You know exactly what kind of guy he is, and you love it. <laughs> I know, but he needs to be so aggravating sometimes. I think Jake doesn't aggravate me sometimes. He has to indulge your ego, then let it go. But Jake treats you so well. And he's gonna be a great husband someday. I know. I just been waiting for him to ask me. I don't know why he's so nervous. What? <laughs> Uh, what the what hell? Did the power go out? Get your phone. Ah! Oh my god. Spider? No, there's a creepy guy in the bathroom. What a purr. No, there really is a weird guy in the bathroom. I told you. I told you this place was weird. Shut up, Bobby. Are you guys sure you've seen someone in the bathroom? Yes. Yeah. Yes, I swear. Let's go. Let's go in the bathroom together and see then. Fine, then you'll see. <laughs> Anybody in here? Hello? Need to pay? Hello? I think we're here. This is the circle, supposedly where the dark one was summoned, actually. All right, Bobby, get the equipment together. The rest of us start setting up camp right around here. Oh, gosh, I'm just suffocating. Shut up. I'm not saying two fires. Hey, hey, shut up. You still call? I can make a better fire than that. <laughs> Girl Scout. Girl Scout. It's like I They honestly want Boy Scouts. Well, wow. Kill the fire! <laughs> Two. I wish there was pizza in the woods. <laughs> did you guys hear that? We all did, babe. You guys cannot be scared right now. That's awesome. Remember, screams are on the planes of this place. That means that could be something here. Maybe it could be campers, but still, it's awesome. It sounded close. 
Haley's getting scared. I'm not. R2. Knock it off. Scott, shut up for a second. I think I heard something. Well, actually. No way, that's impossible. It's possible, Lucas. Just think about it. Okay, we all just need to calm down and relax for a second, seriously. <laughs> I think it's pretty awesome. Guys, I'm getting scared. Can we pack up and leave? Yeah, let's get out of here. We're not going anywhere. We don't have anything on film yet, or anything. What is that? It's a ghost light. It's a spirit trying to manifest itself. Lucas, Mary, and Emily and I will go see if we can get that ghost sign on camera or something. The rest of you guys sit back here, do some EVPs, do what you can, okay? Um, I think I'm gonna stay here. Alright, that's fine, you can stay back here. I wanna go. No, stay back here with equipment, I know you'll take care of it. Also, you need to stay with your sister. We'll be back, alright? Let's go. I think, I think those are bodies. It doesn't make sense. They're not even rotting. Can we please just get the hell out of here? Yeah, we need it. We need to get out of here. Let's go. Come on. Hey guys, what's up? We got some stuff to talk about when Leo and Mary get back. But I guess until then we can just do some EVPs or something. I don't think that's a good idea. Come on, we gotta do something to waste some time. I agree with Emily. Come on, there's nothing to be afraid of. The dark one doesn't exist. I agree with Lucas. I mean, there's nothing to be afraid of. We might as well just do an EVP. Sweet, that's what I'm talking about. Alright, Jake, I guess you can go sit somewhere over there and I'll put the camera on you. Just don't forget to take the voice recorder. Alright, cool. Is anybody here with us? Can you tell us your name? Did we see you earlier? What do you want from us? Hey man, what to say? I'm gonna keep going. Why do you want Haley? I can smell it off of you. I'm not afraid of you. You should be. Haley's gonna die tonight. You stay away from her, you bastard. What are you gonna do? You can't kill what's already dead. Show yourself, you bastard. I'm already here. Jake? Jake? How would you like Haley to die? By your own hand. Please stop. Jake, Jake isn't here anymore. Jake, please let me go. No, please stop. Kill her, Jake. Do it. Do it. Do it. No. You should have let me in. Haley. Jake! 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 Jake? Jake, is that you? Oh my god. Jake. <sighs> Guys. He was just...
wish the boys would hear that. I know, Haley is so upset. I can't imagine if that was Leo instead of Jake. Oh my gosh, I can't imagine what she's feeling. Lucas and I may be mean to each other, but that's just our way of showing how much we love each other. <laughs> then you must love each other a lot. Yeah, at the end of the day, I know he'd do anything for me. I know, Leo is always sacrificing something for me. Sometimes I wish he would just think of himself, be a little selfish. What do you mean? I lost my scholarship last semester because of my grades, and to keep me from dropping out, he sold his grandfather's car that he left him in the will. Oh, it's so sweet, though. I know, but he shouldn't have had to do it. Well, it's just his way of showing how much he loves you. I, I don't want him sacrificing his life for me every time I get into trouble. Oh my, oh my god. god. What was that? I have no idea. Did you hear that? Oh my god. They're not screwing with us, are they? 